In our public service work, people who we help are much more familiar with Wi-Fi type stuff than ham stuff. They're much more comfortable using cell phones, uh, PCs, telephones, especially telephones that work in full duplex, unlike handing them a microphone so they have to do push the talk. And so we can marry Wi-Fi, and radio, and mesh in a way that I'm going to show you here in a moment. And we can get all these people talking to each other using all the devices that they're familiar with without making them do something in an artificial way which seems strange to them. And we can provide the infrastructure to make this happen. A cell phone is a ham radio transceiver and receives and transmits in the 2400 megahertz ham band. So is a computer. And a telephone is certainly more convenient to normal people than just handing you a microphone letting them talk. And this radio allows all these to talk together with normal ham radio equipment. We can make a Wi-Fi to mesh interconnect by having a mesh wireless router, a Wi-Fi wireless router, and connecting them together with an Ethernet cable. So that means that anybody can talk to anybody else in those two worlds. Say we can have somebody over here with a cell phone and somebody over here with a telephone on the mesh cloud, and they can talk to each other, and it's totally transparent. And this can be way far away on the mesh network, not just locally. We can also make a cross band repeater, where we have a mesh node here connected to a PC going through a TNC running to a hand transceiver that then goes to simplex or repeaters or whatever you want to do. So that means that someone over here with a telephone in the mesh cloud could talk to someone over here on a local repeater or using a simplex frequency. <coughs> the receivers to what frequency? You might tune your HT to 146.46 and if we're lucky we'll let you talk on the mesh in just a moment. Now, this is a combination. This little brown suitcase up here contains both of the two things I just talked about. It contains a radio crossband transmitter or repeater and a Wi-Fi to mesh conversion so that everything can all talk to each other. Now, why would you want rather use a cell phone instead of an HT? Well, because we can set the cell phone up I'm sorry, we can set the, the repeater up with radio transmitters <coughs> or repeater to be a high power radio with a high antenna and higher in the air, higher power. So that means you could talk on your cell phone through that repeater and get much further than you could with your HT, assuming that you're not within range of a longer repeater. The other advantage of cell phone is it can send and receive live video which is something that you can't do with your HT. We made some dedicated cell phones, which have the necessary software built in order to do this. And we put a nice front page on it, so it looks like this. And we can hand these cell phones to people and say, OK, do your thing. How this might be used, we could have a group of these dedicated cell phones out here connected to the mesh Wi-Fi radio transceiver, or sorry, repeater, talking to their headquarters over here where they have a bunch of telephones, or they can be sending live video to this uh, PC and displaying on a large screen video. So from the headquarters or the EOC, they can see the, what's happening out at the scene from any of the cell phones that are on the scene. This is all based, in our case, on the use of LinPhone software. This is a wonderful tool we recommend to everyone. It runs on all kinds of computers, PCs, cell phones. It provides audio and video and three-way calling. And actually, we have determined that it does far more than three-way calling. So you can have a whole group of people doing telephones, cell phones, and laptops all talking to each other in a large group. 
And it also records everything, and you can do instant messaging. And it's free for, for you to download. The Linfilm software cloud looks like this, where you have all these different kinds of computers, all talking to each other, all communicate with all others, no internet, no service providers, no cell towers, no wires, and it's free. I also have here a mesh telephone suitcase, which is this blue suitcase that you see up here. It has in it four telephones. I call it my portable telephone company. <laughs> it connects to the mesh, and you can make telephone calls from these telephones to anywhere else. The beauty of this is the telephones have a speed dial capability, so you would otherwise have to dial by IP address. We program that IP address into all the telephones so that you just push a memory button and the call is placed to wherever you want to call. All right, I'd like to do some demonstrations for you. cell towers here. We're just talking to each other. In fact, he can be on the other end of the mesh anywhere far away. And we can be talking back and forth with our cell phones. Okay. Now, you have your uh, HDs ready. You'll have to go over here and answer the call on that PC. Okay. 14646. Oh. Now demonstrate my cell phone through the cross bar computer. Many of you have some other things here. This is the simplest one. Whatever. I'll be free to hear whatever. Okay. Now, this is I'm going to go to the next. Okay, so you see, I can't talk to a man. Or, I don't know. Okay, 